What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess and Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading for all signs. Got to shout out to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so very much. Um, I just want to let everybody know. Um, December, first week of December, I might be off of here for a couple days or I might not. My roommate is moving out the first week of December. Um, so I might transport her to the location she's going. I might not. So um, if you see a posting in about a week or so saying I'm going to be off uh, for a couple days, it's because um, I would, I might take her, I might not. Um, as of right now, I'm not, but it might change. So I just want to let everybody know she's, um, going to get a plot. She's going to get a plane ticket to my knowledge. Um, but I might transport her cause I went and got her from New York originally. I went and got, went and got her from New York originally. Um, but she's deciding to move on. Of course, I didn't make her sign a rental agreement or anything. Um, so she has free will to move on. So, um, she is deciding to move on and um but the but as of right now i'm not going to take her she's getting plain but if i uh put a little posting on here saying um you know i'll be off for a couple days that's why just like the the previous month when i went to go get her from new york okay all right i hope everybody's doing well i do i do i do who Okay, so I uh, received another channel message. I hope everybody's doing well. It's 6, 8, 6, 18 a.m., 11, 26, or 22. Okay, so the channel message I received was um, a child, um, I heard a child is about to run away soon, um, but I heard when the child runs away, um, I heard as a teenager, when they run away, I heard through many series of chain events, it, they're actually going to end up being killed. I heard it's um, it is going to uh, spark huge activity and flurry, and the I heard the stepmother and the karmic father of this child that ran away, they will be in some serious trouble. I heard they will be blamed for the murder, but I heard it will not be them, but they will be blamed for the murder. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, I don't know if it's masculine or femme child, but it is a karmic father and a karmic stepmother. Apparently, they're running away from. They haven't run away from the home yet. Um, I don't know if they've attempted to run away before or if they haven't. I haven't heard any of that, but they are about to run away soon. And it sounds like when they run away through many series of chain events, they will end up being killed. Um, but also heard it's going to cause a bunch of flurry and basically um the stepmother and the karmic stepmother and karmic father will end up being um basically um pinned for the death uh, now i didn't hear how they're going to die or anything like that um but um you plug it in how it resonates they're in a very chaotic home very chaotic home it's very clear these people do not care about them, and they know it. They're in a very chaotic home, a very chaotic home, and it's very clear these people do not care about them. Um, so the teenager, masculine or femme teenager, knows they're in a very uh, uncaring home. They're in a very uncaring home. I heard it's very clear that people do not care about this teenager, but the teenager knows it. And I think that's why they're about to run away. But when they run away... It's going to create some kind of um, a death. It's going to create a death of the teenager. Um, this is terrible. This is really terrible. Let's pull some healings. No. Movement. This is a child running away from home. 
I heard they're in a very chaotic household. Heavy child grooming in this household. Heavy manipulation. Heavy chaos. But they do not want the public to know this. Heavy child grooming, heavy manipulation, heavy chaos, but they do not want the public to know it. So inside the home, it's very chaotic, and there's um, heavy chaos and um, child grooming, I heard, is going on and manipulation. But the karmic mother, uh, karmic stepmother and the karmic father doesn't want the public to know there's chaos and manipulation and child grooming going on. So movement. This is the child about to move away from home. I don't know if it's a masculine or femme, but it is a teenager. The child's health is mental health and physical health has decreased tremendously since moving into this home. They're about to not be able to take it anymore. Nightmares are a part of this too. The child's health, mental health and physical health has severely declined and um, since moving into the home. So it doesn't sound like they've always been in this home. It sounds like they've maybe recently moved into this home or been in this home maybe a few months or maybe a year or I didn't hear a timeline, but it hasn't been their whole life i'll tell you that but um but they are a teenager and i heard soon their mental health and their physical health has declined so both their mental and physical has declined and heard they will not um soon they're not gonna be able to take it no more so some kind of mental break is going to cause them to move uh, to run away movement literally running away literally Okay, I just had a very short vision of a lot of police vehicles. Just now. A lot of police vehicles. It was like six or seven just swarmed around. And it was like a city -ized, urbanized area. Now, what city -ized, urbanized area that is, I have no idea. But it was like a, it looked like city police, SUVs and cars mixed. It was like six or seven of them, like in a group. And the sirens were on and everything. This is terrible. I heard the child's me mental and physical has declined, but they're in a very unloving home. The stepmother is very cold. Very cold. And the father is too. The stepmother is very cold, very cold, and the father is too. So the stepmother and the father are both very cold. Let's pull some tea leaves. This is terrible. Once this occurs, an air sign is going to ever regret being a part of this. Ever regret it. Because it's about to make their reputation tank in a huge way. They live in a different city. Okay, I heard once this occurs, um, an air sign is about to ever regret being a part of this, ever regret it. Um, the air sign lives in a different city. So air sign, if you resonate with this or end up, it hasn't happened yet, if you end up resonating with this, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, you live in a different city for the, this child and the karmic stepmother and the karmic father. Um, I heard uh, you're going to ever regret once, because um, I heard here the teenager is going to end up running away, but they're going to end up getting killed. Um, but you're going to regret ever being a part of this. Somehow you are a part of this. Now, whoever you are and however you plug in to being a part of uh, the child, because the child hasn't always lived there. Somehow there was a transfer of custody from either a foster home or another parent's home or a group home or what have you, what have you. But they are there now, but they're in a very unloving home. 
heard you, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, are going to be very uh, regret you ever did this. It's going to make your reputation in your city go down in a huge way. So you plug it in how it resonates. This can be prevented. But if nobody does anything about this, this is going to happen and somebody needs to hear this. Okay, I heard this can be prevented. Um, this can be prevented, but if nobody does anything about this, it's going to happen and somebody needs to hear this. So maybe you need to hear this air sign or maybe somebody else needs to hear this. But I heard if nobody takes any action on this situation, hotness express going on in this home, this karmic stepmother, karmic father don't want the public to know it's so chaotic in there they're very co unloving uncold uh very cold unkind they can give two shits less about the kids probably about the money or kid because there's one teenager about to run away uh they just obviously care about the money and they obviously got i mean if the there was a recent custody change in some shape form or fashion obviously they probably got money and that's just the truth and um, whether it's foster child or whether it's social security or whatever the hell it is they got money, and that's just the truth. So it's not wasn't about the child; it was about the money. But I heard this can be changed. It can be changed. But if it doesn't, it sounds like this is what's going to happen. And you, air sign, you had a, something to do with this, and you live in a different city than them. I heard your reputation in your city is about to decline in a huge way if this ends up happening. But it can be prevented. But we all know as action takers and movers and shakers in the universe and people that actually want to help the universe in a very positive copacetic manner if you don't take action on toxicity such as this it's going to end up happening and that's just the truth spirit messages you have for pleasure There is heavy abuse in this home. Heavy abuse. There is heavy abuse in this home. Heavy abuse. I heard there's heavy abuse in this home. Heavy abuse. So you plug it in how it resonates. Some kind of heavy abuse. Well, that's what happens when you move children to unhealthy, toxic environments. If anybody needs to hear that. I heard there's heavy abuse there. Heavy abuse. Well, that's what happens when you move children to unhealthy, toxic environments. If anybody needs to hear that. Share your messages to your perspective. And a Sagittarius in this mix, they are about to start going through heavy, heavy, heavy tower moments. Sagittarius feminine. She is, a, she is the stepmother, adult stepmother. Mentally and career-wise. Okay, I heard the stepmother, Sagittarius Feminine, and that would be what I'm assuming why we got the career card. She works out in the 3D. Um, I heard she's about to go start going through some heavy, heavy, heavy tower moments mentally and um, career-wise. So her career is about to decline or have some kind of negative tower moments in it. Um, she's a Sagittarius. She's the Sag Femme stepmother in this uh, situation. Um, how that resonates and applies. Things are about to fall apart for this toxic family in a huge way. Things are about to fall apart for this toxic family in a huge way. her take it things are about to fall apart for this toxic family in a huge way it was all about greed and money and it's about to backfire on them in a huge way okay i heard things are about to fall apart for this toxic family in a huge way it was all about greed and money um so greed and money meaning they got some kind of money for taking this teenager um in some of these situations it might have been several children they took but it was about money, and that's just the damn truth, whether it was just that teenager they took on or other kids. It was all, all about greed and money, but it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. 
And the stepmother in this mix is a Sagittarius Finn stepmother. She's about to start having negative power moments in her career, whatever career she does, and some kind of mental health decline. Well, that's what you get when you take children for greed, for money purposes, and you truly don't care about them. If anybody needs to hear that. Career. She's about to start having unexpected, crazy things start happening to her at work. Out of the blue, everywhere. Unexpected, fast, many of them. She's about to become so overwhelmed, she's about to take it out on members in her household. Okay, I heard, um, so this Sag Femme's coming in strong. Sag Femme, toxic stepmother of this teenager that's about to run away. And I heard once the teenager runs away, they're going to end up dying in some shape, form, or fashion. But um, it sounds like upcoming, she's about to start having, because none of this has happened yet, it doesn't sound like. But she is about to start having negative power moments in her uh, career, in her work. I heard things are about to start coming all over the place. Unexpected, all over the place, negative things. Just overwhelming her at work just boom 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 i heard it's going to cause her stress to increase in a huge ass way she's going to start taking it out on the people in her home meaning probably the teenager that's going to run away that already feels like they that they don't they don't belong there that they uh shouldn't be there that these people don't even care about them um and i heard that it was strictly about money so the teenager is not wrong and that's just the truth i'm sure the teenager has very high intuition. Um, and they can sense that these people do not care, really care about them. Because I heard they don't. It was about the money. But she's about to start having heavy work issues. Very heavy work issues. Fine. Seek out information that will help you. Once the death occurs of this teenager after they run away, and it will happen soon because this stepmother is about to just go through it. And it's about to, she is about to burst in her household. She's not happy in her household. But once this teenager runs away, it is a masculine teenager. There will be the another teenager in the household will finally break and they will tell everything they know when the police get involved. It's going to expose these toxic karmic parents in a huge way. Incest and other very toxic things. Oh my God Almighty, this is terrible. Okay, so okay, so she's about to start going through it at work very heavily, her career very heavily. But she's gonna. T I heard she's not happy in her home. She's not happy in her home space, and she um she basically hates it there. She doesn't want. It doesn't sound like she's happy in her marriage. She's happy with the kid, even though she's getting money off this teenager. There's at least two teenagers in that home. They're getting money at least from one of them, if not both of them. But um, she's not happy in her home. But they're trying to make it out in public like they are a happy family. But they're not. Um, but um, but I heard once, and it's a masculine teenager going to run away. There's at least two teenagers in the home. When the masculine teenager runs away and he ends up getting killed, um, I heard the other teenager 
It's a feminine teenager. It's a fem teenager. It's a fem teenager. She's going to reveal information to the police. I heard once the police get involved, once he gets killed. Um, she is going to reveal, the fem teenager is going to reveal information to the police on incest in the family and other very toxic things. So information on incest to the police from the feminine teenager once the masculine teenager gets killed after he ends up running away and um, other very toxic things going on in their household. But this stepmother is very significant in this. She is very unhappy. It sounds like in her career and her life, but she doesn't want people to know. It sounds like they're doing all this shit for money. She's very unhappy. Very. She's very unhappy, Barry. She's very unhappy. Well, why don't she just get a divorce and move the hell on? And that's just the truth. If she's that unhappy, get a divorce, damn it. Goldfish, increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. After this death occurs of this masculine teenager, so many people are about to get huge, have sp huge spiritual awakenings. Huge. And wake up calls. And there will be one very angry biological mother that's going to file lawsuits on these people. Somebody needs to hear this. Okay, I heard, um, okay, so, like I said, none of this has happened yet, but it sounds like once it does, um, there's an angry biological mother, I heard she's going to file a lawsuit on these people, the karmic stepmother and the karmic father, which the teenager, it's a masculine teenager going to run away, but there's a femme teenager in the household too, there's a femme teenager and a masculine teenager, but the masculine teenager sounds like he's going to run away and he's going to end up getting killed but i heard once he ends up getting killed and all this basically blows all to hell there is a biological mother and for some i feel you could be the biological mother uh, it doesn't sound like you live in this household in this hot, hot mess express and all that shit it sounds like you live away from them for some of you guys i feel your children could have been taken from you and tra and transported into this home toxic ass home away from your loving arms or your protective arms or your loving and protective arms um strictly for their grief is what i feel i heard once all this shit occurs basically you are going to file a lawsuit on their asses and let me tell you if i was you and this i was this person um if i was you and this ends up resonating with you that's exactly what i would do because this is terrible so it's like kids were transported into a home that shouldn't have been transported into strictly for greed and money purposes. The stepmother's not even fucking happy in the home. She's taking it out on her family members that she doesn't even want to be there with. And um, it's causing chaos and toxicity so much so either definitely the masculine teenager doesn't feel wanted or appreciated or loved in the home. He feels a burden or a problem or like he shouldn't be there, if not the femme teenager. And there's some kind of incest going on too and other toxicity. I mean, this is terrible. Why? Whoever the hell made the decision to do this? Why did you do this? I just want to point that out there. Why the fuck did you do this? But I heard she will end up filing a lawsuit once the death occurs. And absolutely, ma'am, I would do the same thing. So I heard many people after the death occurs of the masculine teenager, many people are going to get spiritual awakenings uh, and wake-up calls, um, including you, biological mother. Um, and ma'am, I am so sorry. I know this hasn't happened yet. I've never experienced the death of a child, but I could not imagine if one of mine passed away. That would be one of the worst hurts known to man. And that's just the truth. So if this ends up resonating for you, I am so sorry, ma'am, uh, from the bottom of my heart chakra. I love my kids with everything in me. They are my number one. Um, and I don't have, I have visitation rights right now with my kids, but they don't even want to see me because they're being so mentally manipulated by their father, basically. And 
maybe maybe the person other uh fem, maybe his wife too i don't know but i understand is what i'm trying to say i understand but my kids won't speak to me right now but the last time i spoke to my son he said he wanted to run away so i get it if this resonates for you i get it uh, I mean, I hate that somebody else is going through this. I really do. So nobody should have to go through this kind of toxicity. But this is about to happen for somebody. And I'm so sorry. But I heard spiritual awakenings are about to occur for many people when the death of this masculine teenager occurs. Well, they should have got wake-up calls and not transported. And met, and somebody got too high on their high horse, thought their position of high authority, they were doing the right fucking thing. And they're really not. They just put somebody in a hot bed of toxicity. Fox, shrewdness, and resourcefulness, especially in business. Once this death occurs of this masculine energy, it will go very, very, very public. Very, very, very public. Very. And it's going to cause so many people that were involved with this masculine energy's care and um, and transfer of him to this home. Their business is going to go down in a huge way. They live in a different city. Lawyers, counselors, doctors, psychologists. Lawyers, counselors, doctors, psychologists. Okay, so there were many people involved with basically making the decision to um, move this masculine teenager, if not the femme teenager, because there's at least two teenagers in this household, to this home. But once he runs away and he passes away, it's going to, how the hell are you going to hide a death? And that's just the truth. Um, but um, all these people that made these decisions to do it, they live in a different city than he does. So, once he passes away, I heard it's going to go super public, which it should. It should. I'm sure you, biological mother, you're probably going to make it go public. And that's just the truth. I would. Um, but I heard once it happens, um, these people that, I heard lawyer, lawyers, counselors, um, and teachers, lawyers, counselors, teachers, um, doctors, and psychologists, all their businesses are about to go down. They're about to go down. They should. So resourcefulness, especially in business, that's their business about to drop. Because they, people in their city, knows they were connected with this. And then he, if it, when he ends up passing, the word's going to get around that they were involved with it. And it's going to make their reputations decline in a huge way. Their reputations are about to decline in huge ways after this occurs. Huge. Their reputations are about to decline in huge ways once this occurs. Huge. Yeah. I bet it will. Kangaroo, unsettled times, need to plan ahead. This is about to cause chaos for everybody involved everybody involved this is about to turn into a huge 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 thing nobody stopped the abuse nobody did the right thing and it's about to explode okay i heard this is about to turn into a huge 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 thing nobody stopped the abuse nobody did the right thing and it's about to turn into a huge thing so basically he's him running away is about to create these it's the stepmother she's about to go through it at work which she's an adult whatever you know everybody goes through stress at work things at work she's an adult she can handle her shit it's this step it's the poor kids in this that got caught in the crosshairs of god complex position of authorities that didn't do the fucking right thing somebody knew about child abuse somebody knew about um toxicity in this home but yet they decided to transport them to this home what and i'm just being for real that's not cool if anybody needs to hear that so chaos energy coming for these people in a different city because they their egos were just basically too fucking high 
and they knew or they knew about the child abuse they knew but yet they all collaborated together to do this to this poor if not both teenagers but they're about to get their shit to them and that's just the truth the energy is going to come back on them once he passes away because he don't feel loved he doesn't feel loved he doesn't feel safe he doesn't feel wanted and if he was in a home with the biological mother previous why the hell would you do that to somebody except to cause more chaos if anybody needs to hear that that's sick this karmic stepmother thought she was going to profit off these kids but it is not going to happen it is backfiring it will continue to backfire not going to profit off them any more than she already is social security okay i heard this uh stepmother thought she was going to profit off these kids i heard she does profit off them i heard social security so kids up so i'm assuming both these teenagers she gets social security for these teenagers um ssi um Social Security Administration or SSA or how we say it. She gets Social Security benefits for them um, in some shape, form, or fashion. But um, basically, um, she thought she was going to profit more off them. But I heard she's not. She's not. It's actually going to, um, she's not profiting any more than just the Social Security benefits and it pisses her off. She's a very materialistic, greedy person and it's about to backfire on her in a huge way. She's a very materialistic, greedy person, and it's about to backfire on her in a huge way. Well, it should, and that's just the damn truth. And I'm saying this from a, uh, a single mother that doesn't even have um, full custody of my kids anymore. Um, and I have visitation rights, but like, like I said, my kids, ever since they've been up there for about three months, it's been nothing but fucking chaos up there. So, um, mom won't even speak to me, but it's probably because they're being manipulated by the definitely by the father if not the stepmother not to speak to me and that's just the truth all right i love you guys so much let me see if i hear anything else A very highly intuitive neighbor is about to get wind of the chaos in this home. One of them might end up calling the police soon. Very strongly might. A very highly intuitive neighbor of these toxic ass stepmother, karmic stepmother, and toxic uh, father. Um, I heard they're very highly intuitive. They're about to get wind of all the chaos in the home soon. Um, I heard they might end up calling the police soon, Mike. So you plug it in how it resonates. For some, you might be the highly intuitive neighbor. Um, this is terrible. This is terrible is what this is. I love you guys. I hope everybody. A Taurus is about to get a huge ass fire land under their ass. Taurus is Sagittarius Fem stepmother. A huge fire. She's going to ever regret manipulating him in a huge way. Ever regret it. Okay, I heard a Taurus masculine is about to get a huge ass fire lit under this uh, his ass. So you Taurus masculine, if this resonates for you, um, whoever you are to the side of them. Um, you got Taurus in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, and Minute, which you your charts, but you Taurus masculine, you're about to get a huge ass fire lit under your ass. You know the side of them stepmother. Um, I heard she's about to ever regret manipulating you. So she manipulated you in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, she's about to ever regret it. You're about to get very, a fire lit under you guys, meaning you're going to be pissed. Um, at her 
or about the manipulation or something. Um, I wonder if you're going to, I wonder if you work with her. I wonder if you work with her with the career card. Um, you don't have to, but I wonder if you do. But however you're connected to her, Taurus masculine. You can have Taurus in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, moon, haven, Jupiter charts. Um, but it sounds like you're going to start, um, she's going to ever regret manipulating you. So I think you might start creating power moments for her or something of that nature. I feel for some Taurus masculines, you might work with her. Do you plug it in how it resonates? These two are about to ever, this karmic couple is about to ever regret keeping the biological mother stuck. Ever regret it. She's about to experience huge success. And a water sign is about to completely move away from these people. Completely. Okay, this karmic couple, I heard basically... Uh, they're going to ever regret keeping you, biological mother, stuck. If you resonate over here, they're about to ever regret keeping you stuck, ma'am. I heard you're about to experience huge, great success soon. So something in your life is about to be successful in some shape, form, or fashion, whether it's business or 3D workspace or side hustle or whatever it is, okay? Or a combination. Um, and um, uh, what was the other one? Oh, and a water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, a water sign. I heard they're about to completely just move away from this situation. So whoever the water sign is and how that applies. Um, former lover. Former lover. Former lover water sign. So you could be the former lover water, water sign about to completely move away from them. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, former lover. So you have been in sexual connection in some shape, form, or fashion with either the Sagittarius feminine, stepmother, or the karmic father sounds like biological father um but you are a former lover of either the karmic father biological father or the karmic stepmother um or both if you did swing them i didn't hear you did swing your ship but you might have only you know your situation story not anybody else water sign uh you mean mask or them cancer pisces scorpio i heard you're about to completely move away from these people i don't blame you this is a hot ass mess express and i'm serious I really feel, it, the part, sad part is the kids get the collateral damage of this shit. And that's just the truth. Another fire sign is getting a huge ass wake up call. Huge. Another fire sign, another Aries Leo Sagittarius is getting a huge ass wake up call. So you, high vibrational, high vibrational. You're a high vibrational. You treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, values. High vibrational um, fire sign, you're getting a huge ass wake up call. Aries Leo Sag. This is a hot, somebody needs to fix this before he runs away because he hasn't run away yet. Somebody needs to fix this. There's incest in there. There's toxicity. There's a, a masculine teenager that does not feel wanted or loved or appreciated or valued by his parental unit, which I don't care if you're a single parent or a blended family or a married karmic couple. You should feel loved, valued, and appreciated. And this person, this teenager is not. And there's some kind of incest going on in some shape, form, or fashion, whether it's with these teenagers or somebody else. It's sick. All right, I love you guys so much. Namaste.